Now, a few years ago, when I spent a lot of time in Houston, uh, I know Snoop Dogg went to Houston on his tour bus, and he was making a big deal about uh, not having any security. He was showing up to go uh, show one of his biggest fans some love. It was like a little old lady, a black lady named Shorty, South Park Shorty. She kind of looked like a crackhead to me, but, um, you know, oh, well, I mean, so, you know, but uh, he really made it a big deal that he was showing up with no security in, a, in South Park of Houston while I'm driving all over these areas, you know, I'm all over Houston at that time, including South Park, everywhere. Missouri City, everywhere, you know, and it, it was just like, it felt like competition thing, but really, and then around that same time, I seen that he was, uh, he showed up at a, a Houston a rapper party, and he was walking through, and when Chameleon Air looked up and seen him, he was just like, like, what is he doing here, kind of, I, I don't know, I can't find the video, but I don't know, man. I just kind of got this vibe that it's 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 some shady shit going on. Then you got 50 Cent. He's tight with Snoop. 50 Cent. He he supposedly moved to Houston. Busy Bones been living in Houston for a while. Um, who else? A bunch of these cats are trying to move to Houston or did. And you know when I when I think about who they all are. I, I don't, I don't, their character is very questionable to me, and I wonder if they are, they all came in because they were afraid Houston was showing me too much love, and Houston might swoop me up, and then, you know, people I know from back Sioux City, they, they got connections with Dope House, like, so yeah, I really truly believe these, these motherfucking industry motherfuckers are fucking with my life, dude, been fucking with my life for a very long time, and I got lots of proof and evidence and receipts to prove that, but like, that's, that's, that's pretty, uh, pathetic, dude, that you got a bunch of these industry rappers that move to Houston just to fuck with me, sure looks like it, don't it, they're probably the ones paying these fucking people to follow me around the country, the uh, Pink Pigolo and, uh, Bronco Girl and all these other motherfuckers, and then, they're on the West Coast. That's where the uh, YouTube headquarters is. All the censorship there. Boy, I'm telling you, man. Some people are some hating motherfuckers. They talk about you got to keep it real. Keep it real. Y'all fake as fuck. You fucking YouTubers up, man. Well, I'm telling you, man. These people, man. You should never let these people claim that they are... Uh, uh, children of God, or they believe in God, these people don't believe in God, when they say God in the music, they mean their God, the God of this world, Satan, to them that's God, so when they say all praises to God, that's, that's what they're talking about, in my opinion, 